British firefighters are on their way to Greece to help battle the devastating wildfires that have burned uncontrollably for almost a week. Ten countries have already sent crews and specialist equipment, such as aircraft, to help, while another eight are sending further reinforcements. Mark Mallett has the latest on the fires on the island of Evia. Even the skies above Evia are burnt orange as the wildfires continue to rage. Cracked earth and bone dry conditions brought about by Europe's worst heat wave in decades. No defence against flames which continue to engulf anything in their path. Vast swathes of forest have already been obliterated. On this, the second largest island in Greece. And so the flames invade the towns and villages too, almost cutting Evia in half. Thousands of people have already been evacuated, with Greek Coast Guard vessels and ferries even being used to take people from the beaches on the north of the island. There's no downplaying the mammoth task facing the hundreds of firefighters from Greece and further afield. Planes and helicopters have also been drafted in to dump gallons of water in an attempt to try and dampen the flames. But in a cruel twist of fate, hot and windy weather is proving to be another major obstacle. It started to burn over there at first, and these areas burned down too, said this local resident. The causes of the fires, which have been running for several days now, are under investigation. But Greek and European officials have blamed climate change for the large number of fires that have burned through southern Europe in recent days. Mark Mallet, ITV News.